Hello everyone, I'm Leah Torbert with Harrington Strategic Partners and today I'm bringing you another episode of Harrington's Bookshelf. Our book this week is Coming Up for Air by Beth Sowie. It is How to Build a Balanced Life in a Workaholic World. Today I want to talk about three ways that you can save time every day and help you bring more balance in your life. The first way is to prioritize. Now, in, in my schedule, I use a daily planner and an online calendar. And my daily planner has a section for my top three priorities, the top three things that I have to accomplish for the day. And then there's a general to-do list. And I kind of use that to accumulate things throughout the day that at some point I need to take care of. It may happen today. It may happen tomorrow. It could be next week, but at least I'm collecting it so I'm not worrying about forgetting about it. But every day I make sure I get those top three done. So I prioritized my time. I prioritized my activity and I've accomplished the three main things that I need to do for that day. So at the end of the day, when my work schedule is done, I know that I've gotten done what I need and I can stop stressing out about it and then I can go you know have dinner with my family or go to a movie or you know just sit back and you know have a drink and relax and I'm not worrying about all those added things I need to do the second thing is to delegate delegation is really important if you have someone on your staff that can handle something for you and they have the time to do it let them do it if they need a little bit of training, give them the training. If it's not something that is essential that you yourself take care of it, let someone else do it for you. If you don't have someone on staff that can take care of it for you, you might be able to outsource that to a virtual assistant or a consultant or you know someone else that could take care of that information for you. A great example of that is social media content. And you aren't necessarily the person that is, you know, it's the best time use in the world to create all of the pretty posts that go out on your social media or to write the blog that gets published on your website once a month or every week, whatever your schedule is. There are probably other people that you could you know, have in your organization or pay on a contract basis to take care of that for you and free up time so that you can you know, do what you need to do, get your prioritized tasks done, knock out your activities that have to happen, and move on. You've delegated, you've freed up time in your schedule to do what you need to do. The third thing is to simplify. A lot of times we make things more complicated than it has to be. I work with business owners all the time who you know, have uh, you know, certain mindsets built up about how things work how things are just done. And so we do a lot of discovery and conversation about breaking down this thing that they think they need to do. You know, a good example is, you know, automating your CRM. There are a lot of different pieces that are involved in creating, you know, ways to get leads and then once you have the leads, how to actually process them, how to make the connection, how to try to develop the relationship how to get them through your sales funnel and actually convert them to a paid customer. And then you know, there's another piece where you have to continue following up with them and continue the relationship and try to get them you know, to be a repeat customer. It can be really complicated. And a lot of people that I talk to and that I work with, you try to do all of it all at one time instead of breaking it down into little chunks. If you look at the entire process as a whole, it could be extremely overwhelming. There are you know, a dozen things that you need to happen for this CRM system to work correctly. And we haven't even talked about the training involved to make sure everybody knows how to use it. This is just the moving parts. But if you look at it piece by piece, section by section, everything that needs to be done, you can boil it down to the simple step-by-step -step process and work through everything that you need to do to get it done but you're not stressing out about it as much you're not feeling overwhelmed because you have a plan you know step by step what you need to do and you can keep yourself from jumping ahead and worrying about all the other things and you know wondering oh how is this going to happen how does this even work because you've boiled it down you're focusing on one thing at a time you've simplified the process 
you've simplified everything that you or someone on your staff or a contract worker needs to take care of for you to get it all done. And so you've saved time not only in running around trying to get it all done at the same time, but you're now not worrying about whether it's going to happen or not. You're confident, you know what needs to get done, and then you can focus on other things, whether that's something else you want to get done in your business or going to the movies with your friends and family. Whatever it is that's going to bring more balance to your life and make you happier, do it. You, know, you can prioritize, you can delegate, and you can simplify. And with those three things every day, you can find more time to take care of you and do the things that make you happy in your life and find that balance. If you're interested in learning more about how Harrington Strategic Partners can help you in your business, please visit my website, harringtonstrategicpartners.com. You can access my calendar there and book a free 30-minute strategy session where we can talk about whatever it is that's going on in your business, and you can have actionable items to take away from that call. I'd also love it if you could follow me out on social media. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and LinkedIn. Again, my website is harringtonstrategicpartners.com. Thanks. Bye-bye.